Now, Manchester United decided that Eric Ten Hag will not be sacked before the FA Cup final in just over two weeks. The club are guaranteed to endure one of their worst seasons in Premier League history. Wow. When Monday's 4 0, it, it looked promising last year as well, didn't it? When Monday's 4 0 hammering at Palace, confirming they'll not bet at the lowest ever points tally of 58. The FA Cup final was City's Ten Hag's only chance of salvaging something from a poor season at Old Trafford, but. Drive co-host and big United fan Andy Goldstein believes he shouldn't get the chance to lead his side out of Wembley. They've got three games in the league left and in the FA Cup final. People are talking about Eric Ten Hag leaving the club. Steve McLaren's out at the moment, mm-hmm. right? If Manchester United were to get rid of Eric Ten Hag today, mm-hmm. forget the fixtures in the Premier League. From a club perspective, from a new manager coming in having to build, I don't want the hassle okay. of having European football. I just want to concentrate on the Premier League. I know people are going to go, this is bonkers, but it's, it's not bonkers. Mm-hmm. Manchester United for the FA Cup final against Man City having that dressing room to give the speech beforehand. Yep. Sir Alex Ferguson. So he becomes the manager just for the FA Cup final? Just for the FA Cup final. That gives Manchester United the best chance to beat Man City. He has got something that no one else has. No, he, he, had, that, into, he had that 10 no, no, years no, no. ago. Just, just by walking into a room, he has it. Even now, right? You bring Sir Alex Ferguson in that dressing room at Wembley ahead of Manchester United against Man City and Fergie gives a speech United have got every chance well, so he, he's the manager he makes he, he's just the manager just for that day imagine the lift I mean that's bonkers Him. no it's not no it's not it's it's actually genius uh, Ali I don't think Fergie would do it anyway if he was asked no I know do I to tell you the truth I mean clearly there's nobody who loves a club more than Sir Alex but I, I don't think they'll make a change till the end of the season anyway. And it's it's, it's one of these things, Al. I mean, I, I don't think he'll stay at the club to and hag, to be honest with you, but who are they going to get? Who, I mean, Ali, you said is, it is earlier, it? right? You said it earlier. You're in that dressing room at Wembley. You're playing your big rival, City, who are massive favourites. You, someone's just got to stand up and look oh. at the players and say, do you, a, do you want to be embarrassed in a cup final all around the world? Do you want to play like we did at Palace and get absolutely battered yeah. and people rubbing it in and belittling us? We have got to go out there and fight for our throw-ins, Absol- for free 100%, kicks, for everything. 100% right you are, mate. It doesn't matter who's standing up giving that speech, whether it's the captain, whether it's Sir Alex Ferguson, doesn't matter who it is. If you can't hot kick yourself up for an FA Cup final at Wembley against your biggest rivals, or certainly one of your biggest rivals, you're in the wrong game, Alan. Yeah, and you I don't care. If well. the, I don't care if you're not allowed to upset players anymore. Oh, speak to my agent. But I nearly said something. Oh, I know. No way. It's a cup final at Wembley. It's against City, your rivals, your fans. It's fifty-fifty. It's the end of the season. You've got to give them something. Yeah. Absolutely. I've got to say, I saw a bit of footage of the United fans after the game at Palace and I thought they were brilliant. Away fans always that. are. Man, man, oh, man United well, away fans are brilliant. Well, you've got to say, generally speaking, most away fans you know, are, are the kind of heartbeat of the club, if you like. I know a lot of people can't travel, but at the same time, the away fans are unbelievable. I thought that was the case for the United fans against Palace when I saw them hanging about and singing for their team, which I thought was amazing. Yeah. So, But you're right. They, 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 owe it, they owe it to the fans and, and they owe it to themselves to go in and put a, some kind of level of performance. I think they will. I've got to be honest with you. I, I think they will. I mean, if they, if, if, they, if, they, if they don't, they're, as I said, they're in the wrong game, I think they will. They, they have to go and put a level of performance in. It's FA Cup final. Huh? OK, 0371722344. Taking your calls this morning, United fans. Jonathan's United fan decided who he wants to replace Ten Hag. Good morning, Jonathan. Morning, Jonathan. Morning, boys. How are you doing? Oh, Jonathan. We're doing we're fine, aware, mate. Aware there's so much going on at the moment, but if you're a red, you're thinking, dear, oh, dear. What a season. This has been garbage, hasn't it? It's beyond garbage. And what gets me... Um, said this to you before, I've seen some poor teams, but I've never seen a team that is so spineless, that lacks effort, that is devoid of leaders. And then to top of it, we've got the most deluded manager in world football who thinks we play well when we're awful. <laughs> it's just, it's just, it just couldn't get it well. It could always get worse, but it's not good. What I mean, did Jonathan what did he say 10 days ago at the press? You're embarrassing, you're embarrassing, not yeah. me, you're embarrassing. I'm like, shut up. 
Oh, every single excuse you can think of. The injuries. I'm surprised he's not blamed the laundry ladies. You know, there's always someone to blame but him. And then Bayern Munich are talking about getting him. Let him go. I'll drive him <laughs> to the airport. Let me tell you. <laughs> Jonathan, try and enjoy the final. It's going to be tough, mate. Thank you. Talk Sport Breakfast with Alan Brazil. Thursday and Friday morning, 6 till 10. On AM, on DAB, via the Talk Sport app and on your smart speaker. Talk Sport.